Hey guys, uh, welcome to your general uh, reading energy check-in. This is going to be for the zodiac sign of Cancer, Sun, Moon, uh, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Uh, this is going to be for the end of August going into September. So we are going to take a look at your over energies, uh, what's surrounding you guys, what you guys need to know, what you guys can expect for the end of the month. And then we'll see what the possible outcome and advice are. Um, so this could be anything, love, relationships, friendships, uh, family, career, finances, personal development, spiritual development. Um, we'll just see what the cards pick up. Uh, before we get started, if you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on new videos that post onto my channel. Give this video a thumbs up, like this video so that this message can circulate around to the individuals that need to hear this. Uh, share this video with someone. If you feel like there's someone out there that needs to hear this, leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonated. Those of you that are interested in booking a private personal reading with me, the link is in the description box below. Alright, Cancer, let's get started. Over, over energies for Cancer. What is surrounding Cancer? What does Cancer need to know? What can Cancer expect for the end of August going into September? Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. All right, the Page of Pentacles in the reverse here. So Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Energy. Feel free to apply this to your own unique situation. The rules could be flipped or reverse. Um, so you could be dealing with someone with Earth in their chart, or you might have Earth in your chart. Right, the Strength card, Leo Energy. The Star, Aquarius Energy. Temperance, Sagittarius Energy. Five of Cups and the Page of Swords. So, Cancer, I feel like you could be waiting for an apology from someone, like you're patiently waiting for someone to apologize, but I feel like whoever this person is, this person is not going to come in to apologize. I don't know if this person is lazy. I don't know if they don't want to do the work. I don't know if they have, uh, you know, an inflated ego, like they've no done nothing wrong. The thing is, I do feel like this person regrets what they did to you. I'm not quite sure what they did. Maybe they walked away from you. They made you wait or something like that. Um, maybe they were emotionally unavailable. Uh, or that, you know, they didn't really speak on what their intentions were towards you, or they hid a lot of secrets. Because they feel like someone here is wanting only one relationship. And that could be you. I mean, Cancer, this person could be spying on you, watching you. Trying to figure out what you are up to. So this could be done through social media. This could be done by, you know, going to your favorite coffee shop or something like that. But I feel like you're patiently waiting for this person to apologize. I feel like this person has a bit of an inflated ego. I feel like this person's not going to do that. Um, because you're trying to heal from this. I feel like you are healing, but I, f I feel like you're still expecting that apology. A part of you is still expecting that apology from this person. Could be dealing with someone that's younger than you. We have four of wands here with the page of pentacles in the reverse. Why is the strength card here? So you could be dealing with the twin flame here, uh, uh, Aries. Could be dealing with an Aries, uh, but... Um, it could be dealing with the twin flame here. It doesn't have to be uh, Cancer. Why is this uh, strength card here? Why is the strength card here? Oh, I grabbed two. Six of Cups and the Sun card. 
what I'm getting here is that this person is missing you. But this person is too in their ego to come in to apologize. Why is the star card here? Three of Cups. I mean, I feel like this person is hoping for some sort of reunion, but, you know, they might be living in La La Land, um, you know, expecting a reunion, but not, you know, coming in with a sincere apology here. Why is this a temperance here? All right, temperance, seven of wands, and the queen of pentacles. So this could be you right here, perhaps, uh, Cancer. You could have earth in your chart. Like I said, I feel like you're pushing this away or you're sort of like defending yourself in this defense mode or like you're protecting your energy here. Why is this five of cups here? Why is this five of cups here? Five of Cups and the Tower. This person is not, I mean, this person is really, 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 re really regretting causing this Tower moment here. So whatever Tower moment here, maybe someone here kept a secret and the secret was revealed and this blew this, uh, this, blew this uh, connection up. So apply this to your own unique situation, uh, Cancer. You could be dealing with a partner, an ex, a friend, a family member, a coworker. Uh, this is a general read, uh, uh, energy check-in. Why is this page of swords here? The eight of wands. So we, someone here is looking to communicate. Someone here is wanting to second, wanting a second chance here with you. Um, look at that. You could be dealing with someone who is a fire sign here. Uh, Aries, Leo, Sag, maybe Sagittarius. I mean, someone here is trying to, trying to come back to win you back. Um, but I feel like you're not going to take this person back, Cancer. I feel like you're just waiting for an apology. You're hoping for an apology here. Uh, so let's see what else we have for you. Possible outcome and advice here for Cancer regarding their situation for the end of August going into September. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs for Cancer. judgment again this is on the bottom of the deck we have the chariot so there you are cancer right there chariot two of cups here we have the two of wands lots of twos we have the page of pentacles now in the upright here we have the death card scorpio energy we have the ace of swords I mean, someone here is definitely wanting a second chance, wanting to communicate here, you see? Perhaps apologize for betraying you, for hurting you here, for keeping secrets, for not being open, transparent, honest here. Um, could have been you could have been playing a lot of guessing games with this individual, uh, Cancer. Uh, why is this uh, chariot here? Tell me about the chariot. Why is this chariot here? Chariot and the Two of Pentacles. So moving forward, I don't know if someone here is trying to decide whether to come back or restart this relationship because someone here is coming back with an apology. Now they're trying to come back. 
but for a long time, maybe this person didn't want to apologize because they felt like they didn't do anything wrong. Why is this Two of Cups here? Two of Cups and the Seven of Swords. You know, there's definitely lies and deception surrounding this connection. There will be if you continue to, if you do allow this person back into your life, uh, it's just going to keep happening. Why is this Two of Wands here? Two of Wands and Judgment showing up again. Why is this Page of Pentacles here? Uh, we have the world. So we have someone here that is waiting for an apology here. Cancer, I feel like you're not going to get the apology that you want because you feel like this person is going to lie to you or just not be sincere about the apology. Why is this a death card here? You got the Eight of Pentacles. I feel like someone here is working really hard to change and I feel like it's this young energy here. Why is this uh, Ace of Swords here? Ace of Swords and the death card. Mm. It's like you don't want this person back in your life, but you want the apology, I feel. Because I feel like you're really hurting over this. You're really hurting over this. I feel like this apology would mean a lot to you. But I feel like you know that you're not going to get it, but you still want it. You still want it. Yeah, I, I, don't, I, I feel like you don't want to be with this person again. You just want the apology because you know that there's going to be lies and deception here. This person is going to keep secrets from you. Um, I do feel like you're dealing with someone that's a bit younger than you. It doesn't have to be, but it could be someone that is your age or older than you, but they're just really immature. So, Cancer, I hope this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Give this video a like. Share this video. If you haven't done so yet, uh, subscribe. Ring the notification bell. I will speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks.